Police are warning protesters they are going to get arrested if they don't leave the site of a new police training center in southeast Atlanta. Several have already been arrested, accused of attacking police and construction workers there, throwing a Molotov cocktail and also throwing stones. Doug Richards was out there this evening. He has the very latest update. The old Atlanta prison farm site became a political flashpoint last year as some Atlanta residents fiercely opposed construction of a new law enforcement training facility here. Even though the city council approved the project, the opposition continued. Opponents quietly occupied parts of the property and built a makeshift village with an eye on preventing construction. Now police say when they entered the property with construction workers around midday, the people living here without authorization attacked them with rocks and at least one Molotov cocktail. Police arrested eight of them and say more face arrest. It is illegal to be on the property. Uh, there's not public access here. And so if those individuals would leave, uh, there will be no arrest. Uh, but if you do remain on the side of the property, if you attempt to harm uh, law enforcement officials, if you attempt to destruct property of the city of Atlanta, you will be arrested. Protesters want the property to remain green space. And some of them say a new law enforcement training center will make police more militarized in Atlanta communities, which police say is not the case. Construction here hasn't begun yet, but police say that their presence here today was intended to start that process to an extent they expect full-scale construction to begin later this year. In southeast Atlanta, Doug Richards, 11 Alive News.